Hi everyone, my name is Natalie and I'm a third year here at UVA. Hi, I'm Sydney Williams and I'm also a third year at UVA. And we are the co-founders of UVA RAM and this video will tell you a bit more about our goals for our upcoming Charlottesville RAM Clinic. Hi, I'm Herman Mark Schwartz. I'm a professor at the University of Virginia in the politics department and also in Baton School. And a lot of my work is about the welfare state in America and other countries. Um, and I'm also a volunteer for um, RAM USA, which is remote area medical. And what RAM does is provide free, as in free, no cost, no questions asked, vision, dental, and to a lesser extent, medical services to people who need this in the state of Virginia and other parts of the US. Quality medical, dental, and vision care has the power to change people's lives. And luckily, through Remote Area Medical's free pop-up clinics across the US, they do just that. Patients will line up outside the doors for hours just for their chance to receive free medical, dental, and vision care. And luckily, RAM asks no questions. The only question they ask is, where does it hurt? And since RAM's founding in 1995, they have served over 700,000 individuals and provided more than $135 million in care. So we expect to add to these numbers in Charlottesville after we've witnessed the same level of need here in our own community. And that is why our ultimate goal is to host our own RAM clinic here in Charlottesville, Virginia. And we may think that Charlottesville is um, an okay place to live where everybody has basic medical care, but that's only true to a certain extent because Charlottesville is very rich. And Charlottesville actually sits in an island um, of six counties in which there are a lot of poor people with limited access to health care. Medicare, Medicaid, these things don't cover vision and dental services except in certain limited ways. Charlottesville and Albemarle counties may appear to be wealthy, but they are surrounded by areas of significant poverty. On average, 11.7% of the population is uninsured, and 12.5% of the population is impoverished. There is a significant shortage of primary care physicians, especially in more rural counties. The massive turnout in nearby clinics is a good example of why Charlottesville needs its own clinic. You'll find that this is an incredibly meaningful experience. You will discover right away that helping people um, who are incredibly grateful for your uh, volunteer efforts um, is the best feeling in the world. Um, I can tell you that it's the most important thing in my life after sleeping and eating. As part of this community, we want to make a meaningful impact on the place we call home. We also want to engage the passionate student population by providing our peers with the amazing opportunity to serve with this organization. When we're not planning for our own clinic here in Charlottesville, we're organizing opportunities for students to travel to nearby clinics to volunteer. Your donation will help us serve this incredible organization as well as the greater Charlottesville community. Thank you! Okay, that was good. Thank I think you. so.